transportation in plants at the end of the season you will able to know the function of xylem and phloem cell and explain transportation in plants all plants need water plant roots absorb minerals and water from the soil water absorption is mainly carried out by root hairs these narrow walled hairs greatly increase the area where water absorption can take place water and minerals enter the root by three pathways apoplastic symplastic and transmembrane pathway if water and minerals move from cell to cell through spaces between the cell wall then it is known as apoplastic pathway in symplastic pathway the water and minerals move across the cytoplasm via plasmodesmata and finally reaches to the xylem and when it crosses membrane to membrane is called transmembrane pathway now xylem vessels are long narrow hollow tubes containing no living material the xylem transport water and soluble minerals from root to the other parts of the plant about 95% of absorption water is lost from the leaf thus process is called transpiration the number of stomata eventually move at the lower surface of the leaf if transpiration happens throughout the day then there will be a great loss of water this is controlled by the stomatal opening and closing mechanism During the day time, water enters into the gut cell along with the potassium ions. This being about the change in shape of gut cells and stomata opens. During night, the potassium ions and water molecules leave the gut cells. Thus, the turgidity decreases and the stomata close. Stomata also act as a main site of gaseous exchange in plants. Leaves make use of water and carbon dioxide for photosynthesis. Glucose formed during photosynthesis. Now this is transported to the other parts of the body through phloem cells. And oxygen is released from the stomata. Phloem tissue consists of less specialized nucleate parenchyma cells called sieb cells and companion cells. Transport of food and phloem can be upwards and downwards to the stem to reach all parts of the plant. Hence the transportation in plants in the function of xylem and phloem cells.